All right, before I begin, I would like to give a quick shout out to Pseudo Linux for this nice, simple wallpaper for Total OS today. So, Pseudo Linux, thank you. And this is one of the reasons why, as a Windows user, I love the Linux community. All right, let's have some fun. All right, before I do this, let me just say that this is strictly my opinion as a Windows user on why sometimes Windows sucks compared, compared to Linux. And yes, there will be a flip side of this on why Linux sucks compared to Windows. Now, I'm doing this for fun, uh, partly and partly for newbies, for beginners who are curious about the world of Linux and just want a couple straight answers. But for this one, my top five reasons on why Windows, well, is not quite as user-friendly as Linux. So let's get started. Reason number five, ease of use. You know, a lot has changed in the last 10 years since I first started, lo uh, not losing, but using Linux really over 10 years. Um, it's not just for geeks anymore. There are a few out of the hundreds, there are only a few Linux distributions called distros that are truly easy to use for beginners. There's Zorin OS, there's Linux Mint, and my personal favorite, Ubuntu Mate. Now, of course, there are others to choose out there, but I'm strictly choosing the ones that I've been familiar with over the years. But number five reason, ease of use, Linux isn't just for geeks anymore. Reason number four, there are many desktop flavors. The beauty of Linux, say you downloaded oh, Linux Mint, let's say the XFCE version, desktop environment. Now say you like the way Linux Mint operates, but you're not too crazy about the looks. Well, you can download what are called different desktop environments, such as Mate, Gnome, and a few others. So if you're not too crazy about how it looks, but you like how it performs, you can try different desktop flavors for Linux. Number three reason. Now this is debatable, I'm sure, but I don't recall ever having an issue with community support for Linux. Now most of it is here on YouTube and making fine friends like yourselves. But overall, community support for Linux for me has been a positive experience. Reason number two. In general, I do believe that Linux, a Linux-based system, is more secure than Windows. Now, let's not confuse uh, let's not confuse security with privacy. Once you get on the web, I'm not sure if privacy exists on the web the way it should. But in terms of security and not having to worry about viruses in general, although Linux can certainly get viruses, absolutely, and who knows? A year from now, two years from now, who knows about the amount of viruses that Linux will get. But in terms of malware in general, I do believe Linux to be more secure. My number one reason, oh, Windows, but yeah, my number one reason why Linux is better than Windows, and this is my number one reason that Windows completely sucks, the update process. You have updates. It notifies you. Way to install the updates. Reboot one, two, 42 times. Maybe reboot one last time. Oh, you have to install some other updates. Okay. That's a bit, of, that's a bit of an exa exaggeration, but years ago, somebody said that the update process in Windows is wash, rinse, and repeat. Not so with Linux. The Linux update process is, without getting technical, it is streamlined, it's faster, it's better. So overall, Linux has the way superior update process. So thank you, Linux. That's it. Those are my top five reasons why, at least for these reasons, this is why Windows sucks compared to Linux. If you have other reasons or if there's anything I missed, please post them in the comments below. And like I said, yes, there will be there will be a flip side to this on why Linux sucks compared to Windows. Hey, nothing is perfect. Take it from me, I've been doing this for 10 years and I dual boot between Windows and Linux. I'm using more Linux than Windows. But overall, 
I would have to say that the last couple of years, my adventure into the Linux desktop has been has been friendly, has been nice. It's been comfortable, it's been a lot of fun, and that's why I still continue doing these videos. That's all I have for this one. If you haven't already, please do subscribe. Please consider supporting this Total OS Today channel. I wouldn't be here without you guys, so please help out, help out if you can. All right, have fun with this video. If I missed anything, please let me know. No insults were intended for to anybody, strictly my opinion on the top five reasons on why Linux is superior than Windows. Be safe, I'll catch you on the next one.